Hello everybody, Sift here again with another rotator run. And today I'm gonna be doing a run with Loud. Let's go for the ghost axe just to stack damage. And today's idea is going to be that we're gonna go for a community run. So as many opponents as possible on the screen, and then as many communities as possible. So we're gonna get crazy weird uh, scaling and unscaling damage values, which in my opinion is fun. And, and let's see how this is gonna go. Axe through. I'm, I'm full life here, so might as well go in the middle of the... Oh, no, 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 no. Almost died there. Three life, 146. We will begin, I, in my opinion, with uh, a panda. Maybe three pandas, just to get my luck and uh, max HP rolling real quick. Uh, let's get five luck. Uh, I'm going to say let's go movement speed here. I'm going to say another five luck. Let's get gentle alien for even more opponents. Ghost axe, because exactly. Ghost axe again. And now a gentle alien. Let's roll these. And another ghost axe. And another gentle alien. And also a limited... Uh, bag so we get money so with four ghost axes hopefully we're gonna survive here we also have oh we got like 50 dodges right there that's the power of having a bunch of ghost axes gives you dodge although we lose armor of course we also got already two boxes so this is looking decent this is looking really good um i'm still a bit afraid of getting hit here but it's okay we we are surviving our luck is carrying us i see the trees let's maybe try to rotate over to the trees maybe i'm gonna get one box out of it i wasn't fast enough it's okay Let's rotate down to two more pandas, and then after that, we should be set. Now, my damage is, of course, not, uh, still on the higher end of things, so, um, yeah, we should be good to go. Six dodge, four melee damage. I'm gonna go with four melee damage. That's gonna increase my damage exponentially, theoretically speaking. Let's go six movement speed. Let's go to armor, as I'm losing armor here for no reason. I mean, the reason is we because we get the ghost axes. Uh, and now gentle alien, very nice. I want a bunch of gentle alien if I can. And now gentle alien, I could go for these. Uh... Yeah, I can go for these. I mean, I, I can buy them and I can sell them if I don't want them. Let's take this. Better have something, right? Let's continue with the gentle aliens. Even more gentle aliens. And a ghost axe is here. So let's throw this away. And can I get another ghost axe? Nope, I'm out of money. Let's go. Five ghost axes and one flint. The reason why I don't need the flints is because uh, I want to go with... Uh, as, as we said, we're most likely gonna go with the community support. So my damage, my attack speed is gonna fluctuate from madness into insanity. So I, I don't really need to have even more attack, even more attack speed than madness and insanity combined. Now I am running here a bit through the opponents, which is a bit dangerous. Uh, but it's okay because we're definitely scaling stats, which is uh, the opposite of dangerous. And now my stats is at 78% damage. And uh, yeah, I think I should go like, uh, let's go the scaling stuff. So let's go with wine grind sleeve, uh, one anvil. Actually, let's go two, three, four anvils, whatever. Let's start scaling as fast as we can because there is no real reason to try to, uh, there is no real reason to try to uh, specifically upgrade the items. And look at this, Ghost Flint literally avoided both. So let's, let's throw that away and go here and here. Made the damage, of course, an original alien. None of these, to be honest. Yes, break those in one hit. Both of these are yes. Let's roll. None of these either. Honestly, no. Uh, an alien worm. I mean, food is definitely something we're going to be gathering, but butterfly is definitely a no. Blood leech is also a yes. I meant a yes, by the way. When I said no, I meant yes. <laughs> crit, a crit chance against damage, definite yes. And HP region loss is also a yes. I'm sure for that. Um, yes on that. Let's combine here so we get another blue axe. Let's also lose lifesteal for range and attack speed. And I think we're good to go. And I think we're good to go. Nice. We got a little bit of range here. I now just need to fix my attack speed. Yeah, actually having more ranges feels really weird and bad. But it's okay. We definitely need to get our armor up and running, which is gonna happen. I think we are still in one of the more dangerous waves. Like, uh, only early game is dangerous in these runs, of course. Because by using the golden chests, we have a very good control of what is happening in this game. And uh, opponents are already spawning too many. <laughs> what? Why did I say this this way? Yeah, already too many opponents are spawning. And uh, I need to start investing into those good old things we want. So, first of all, we're going to go with uh, one. Oh, I have five. Yeah, I have five. Now we're going to go with uh, another one of these. And now I'm going to just start investing into the community supports. One, two, three, four. And now we're going to be gaining crazy attack speed based on how many opponents are on the screen. And guess what? There are going to be a lot of opponents all the time. So damage against range, I'm going to say yes. The closer my range is, the better. Price is cheaper. I continue buying axes just to uh, just to start upgrading faster. Want range against attack speed. Oh, ghost axe, very nice. Crit chance against armor is a yes, at least in my opinion. Lifestyle against harvesting is the most yes that ever yes. Armor against speed, mm, I'm going to say yes to that and also lose some damage. Healing turret, might as well have some healing, right? 
on the map. We don't lose anything here. Range damage is relevant to us. Crit chance is what I care about. So this is a yes. And this is also a yes. So we can heal a bit better. This is dangerous. This is also a yes. Uh, let's combine these and buy this. And I find another one. Each region is not really something. Uh, more enemies, definitely yes. And lifesteal. And even more lifesteal. Uh, a bunch of armor related things. None of these, to be honest. And not most. We're going to lock this down. And we're going to also lock down this. And we're also going to lock down this. And let's go. Uh, let's go. Uh, okay, so now my attack speed should fluctuate. 300%. 300 back to 180. Up to 300%. Yep, this is going to be the most fluctuating run we had with attack speed. What attack speed is concerned. And uh, my idea is that at some point, uh, close to, I don't know, wave 10, wave 15. At some point, I'm going to increase my attack speed even more by making... Uh, by changing the game busters around, you know, by using this mod pretty much and making it so that 100%, 100 times more opponents appear. And that's of course gonna get multiplied by the 50% more opponents that my character has. That's gonna also get multiplied by pretty much everything, actually. The items we have, the, uh, this guy's ability, everything is gonna multiply that. Okay, so, um, I think we're done with pandas. Yeah, I mean, I have 103 something luck. Actually, no, why are we done with pandas? We definitely want to continue what we're doing. So, first of all, I definitely need uh, anvils to scale armor, as far as I'm concerned. Unless there is something that's faster at scaling armor. No, there isn't. These are 5 armor per piece. So, this is like, right now, this is 100 plus, uh, not 100, this is like 3D armor. With the end of the run. I will need this armor at some point anyway. So, wait a minute. Will I? Yeah, maybe I should stop going for armor. Yeah, maybe I made a mistake. Ah, it doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. At the end of the day, we're gonna get everything that we want anyway. Like, uh, if I don't go for armor, then uh, I will still be able to get just dodge. Which, uh, I mean, if I have 60% dodge, I'm, I'm cool. I'm cool, I'm cool with it. I don't know why I'm talking like that. Uh, melee damage was there. Let's get the luck though. Definitely get luck even if we lose damage. Opponents move slower. Uh, my dodge is easily gonna scale. I don't need to take plus 8 dodge, to be honest. Free reroll, might as well, whatever. Luck, range is a no. Crit chance is a yes. This is a yes. None of these. Ooh, none of these. Piercing, useless. And not a mouse, very nice. And crit and dodge. Losing range. And a uh, bunch of stats. Losing crit. I mean, yeah, losing crit isn't good, but still, it's decent. Uh, let's get 12% damage is useless. All of these are useless, actually. I don't want them. Let's go. Let's go. Now my attack speed's gonna be even bigger. 280, 260. Uh, now I'm gonna start investing. Uh, maybe pickup ranges for a bit later, to be honest. I think I don't even need to go through the shop, in my opinion. So maybe we're gonna stop going through the shop. As there isn't really anything that I m might want. Maybe mouses. Yeah, maybe I'm gonna go through the shop just to buy all the mouses possible. And maybe all the gentle aliens. Uh, which, can, uh, I'm gonna look. The moment we go into the shop, I'm gonna see what the max amount of those things are. And then we're gonna know how many more we need to find. And then after that, we're done with the shop. And gonna, we're only gonna be looping through here with crazy attack speed and whatnot. Look, 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 and game starting to lag, which means I should actually try to increase my range. Game is starting to lag, or I guess decrease my range so it increases. I don't know. Now we're gonna only go community support. Now the decision is made. So now we're spamming this thing until my armor falls off. I don't need attack speed. <laughs> I don't need attack speed. Uh, let's get range. I don't know. Where's my range at, by the way? Plus. I mean, if it's plus or minus, it's almost the same thing. So, mouses. So, let's see how many... So, gentle aliens are done. The limit is 10. And mouses are also done. Okay, so we're done. <laughs> let's go, just next round. Instantly. I still believe that I, knew I do need to build up range. Because, yeah, I mean, we definitely have the attack speed. Well, if I don't need to build up range, I definitely need to build up movement speed. It's one or the other. Or maybe both. I can get some wings. I can get like 50 wings or something. That's gonna give me an F50. Yeah, I mean, 50 wings is good. Maybe I should invest into like... I don't know. I'm gonna say I'm gonna invest into... This wave, I should invest like everything into pandas. And then next wave, I should invest everything into wings. And then after that, I should invest for the rest of the game everything into um, community support. And after I do that, I should um, make it 100% more opponents. Oh, I should also at some point invest into pickup range, of course. Because we don't want all these pickup things to lag our run as they do. So, uh, there's that too. Very nice. We got 400, 500k coins, which is irrelevant, by the way. Okay, so this round we're gonna invest a bunch into pandas. I think at 500 uh, luck, yeah, at 500 luck we're okay, in my opinion. And now I'm gonna invest a bunch into wings, so I get range and movement speed. Because I want movement speed, let's go 20 luck. Let's go with movement speed. Let's go 9 dodge. Uh, is my dodge maxed out? Yep, my dodge is maxed out. 
And I just need to, yeah, continue gaining range. I mean, that's that's it, pretty much. I could go for Rip and Tear, but honestly, I don't want to. Uh, even more range. Lose armor for attack speed. Definite, yes. Uh, do I need to re-roll here? Mm, I, think, I think I don't need to re-roll anymore. Like, I am rolling through these, I see. Life still very nice. Crown, let's take it. And wisdom very much. Thank you very much for the wisdom. Mm, melee damage. Pick up range and melee damage. Coupon. I mean, as you see, pick up range. There are a bunch of things here that definitely fit the build. Uh, minus range and get melee damage and range. I mean, would be nice if I was going for the negatives. Yeah, I don't think I want to go through this anymore. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, I, I like how I begin with very slow attack speed. And then I start just scaling up. I have only 300%, 500%. The more opponents there are, the more attack speed we have. And that's enjoyable. And I think at this point we can actually just straight up go with uh, 100 times more opponents. Yeah, I don't think there is an issue on that anymore. So let's go. Let's do it. Whoop, whoop. This is risky. Might crash the game. But I'm gonna try my best. If it's not gonna crash the game, I mean, it might lag with my PC at least. But as long as I'm up to, like, as long as as long as I'm where I'm supposed to be and I'm clearing out the opponents that are spawning, I, the, the PC shouldn't lag. So let's fight. Let's fight 100 times more than what we should have. Dun, 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 dun. By the way, look how fast my damage is scaling. Do you see my damage? Just literally every hit is scaling it. Look at this 600, 611, 625. We just scale the damage. Oh, look, a, a mega XP. <laughs> 500 coins. Uh, this is a pickup thing, as I said. I don't know at what point pickup is okay. Uh, let's say a thousand. I would say at a thousand it's okay. Yeah, it should be global at this point. Let's invest into a couple more pandas so we get more items. Let's invest into even more wings. And I think we're good here. And now for the rest for the community support. I don't know. We're gonna see. Is dodge maxed out? Yes, dodge is maxed out. Uh, crit chance. Crit chance. Why not? Movement speed. Attack speed. Eh, whatever. It doesn't really matter. It really doesn't. Crit chance is like the only thing we are missing right now. So, um, I'm trying to maybe find some crit chance, but if it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen. Range, I should have picked that up. In general, I should pick up range. And now community support, nice! Nice! This guy's community support is one of his main items, it seems. Otherwise, I would not be fighting it. Like, speaking against lifestyle is a yes. I know I bought them in different order than what I should have, but whatever. It doesn't really matter. Uh, my dodge is over capped, so might as well take this. And more range is definitely a yes for less. And more damage is... Ah, no, we're scaling so much damage so fast. Uh, I have... Yeah, we're good, we're good, we're good. Community support provides us damage. By the way, the more community support I'm gonna be gaining, the more damage we're gonna be gaining. So, yeah, that's a thing. That means we're gonna become crazy fast at some point with attack speed. And now I'm gonna start investing everything into community support. I think I got the global pickup range. I mean, if I even if I don't have global pickup range, I can just be in the middle of the map. So, I will be always zigzag through the map, so the pickup range is always gonna be a thing. Like, it's gonna be working. It's its job. I like how I have like 2,000 attack speed at one point and then 500 at the next one. <laughs> one second you're a god, next second you're nothing. Love it, love it, love it. Clearing out shop. 1,000 plus attack speed. 800% damage. Damage continues scaling forever. Good thing we have wisdom with us. Nothing is carrying us. The jokes. The axe madness. Look at all these supporters that are joining us and we're just chopping them down. We are the evil guy uh, in this story. Spam the community support. Now you're gonna see my armor go into the most negatives ever. But the thing is, it doesn't matter. I don't even know how I'm scaling life, by the way. I guess from the pandas. Like, it, it isn't scaling life. I know, I know, I know. I have the wings leaf or whatever. Uh, but... I have Christians. 20 lag, even more items. Uh, I guess range. Now we're gonna get a couple more wings if I need range. These are useless crit chance. Made a damage, let's go. Cool. Uh, I don't care, let's go. Let's go, even more attack speed. Attack speed is 5,000 right away. Look at all these guys coming over here to support me. Hey supporters, how's it going? <laughs> all these supporters just joining the stage to provide me with crazy attack speed. 10,000% attack speed with all my crazy supporters. Love it. I'm zigzagging through them. I definitely need to get the thing. Uh, the thing. I definitely need to get the um, wings. I need to get more wings. So, first of all, I get more movement speed. And secondly, I get more range. Most of the, bo mo both things that the wings provide us with are uh, for this build. Made for this build. So, we're gonna continue slashing through everything. 
Now, for weapons, I'm not sure if axes was the choice, but I don't think it really matters, to be honest. It, it really doesn't. Maybe maybe some kind of weapon that normally has a very low attack speed. Maybe obliterator. You know what? I'm gonna maybe do a, an attack speed obliterator build uh, next. So, first of all, let's invest into a couple of wings. Golden wings. Da -na 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 -na. My speed, uh, let's go with 500 speed. 500 percent speed, and now everything else in the community support. Most likely for the rest of the run. My armor's in the bin, as I told you it's going to be. It, it doesn't even make sense to go for armor anymore. I'm taking 82% more damage. Does it matter? I don't think so. Let's go. I'm ready. I do have a pretty decent speed. Oh, no. Ah, no, it's good. I was about to say, oh, no, because the axes were flying off, but uh, no, it's good. The good thing with melee axes, uh, with melee weapons, with crazy attacks in general, especially swinging ones, is that they don't care. They just hit the first target in their path. The, because the issue with non-swinging ones, like, um, I don't know, daggers or spears or whatever, is that they fly off and then they get stuck. Like, if you go and see the Rayman run I had, hopefully a card is gonna appear at the top right. Um, the, I had huge punches and when I was throwing them out, they were just stuck. Because the melee weapons that go in a line actually fly out and seem to have an animation at the end of the line while this they just do a, a moon shape thing like a crescent shape like they, they do I, I, um, they do this move if you see over here at the black side I'm, I'm showing like they do like this whoosh, whoosh. they just do slash instead of going oof oof and go outside and just straight up miss everything sound effects of sift they go oof oof or fish fish <laughs> uh, so we don't need any more range we're definitely gonna go everything into community support. We're gonna have at some point minus 100% 100 uh, 100% more damage taken or something crazy. Which doesn't even matter because we have 375 life. And the maximum damage our opponents can do is I think about 25. So uh, theoretically the maximum amount of damage we can take should be... Um, well, if we want to go logically about this, it's... What was I trying to say? So if opponents do 25, let's say opponents do 3 damage and I take double damage, I, the maximum amount of damage I can take is 60. At 60 life I'm not dying, as I have 43% life steal and also millions upon millions of healing drops behind us chasing us. But I'm taking 93% more damage. By the way, you cannot take more than half percent more damage. I'm pretty sure the dev is going to change that at some point because it doesn't make sense. Hey look, we're attacking very slow and now our attack speed. If I stay in the middle, it should be visible how the attack speed increases. Look at this. I mean, we're attacking still pretty slowish in my opinion. I we could have gone faster. From 20k attack speed, let's bring it down to 16k. Can I bring it below 10k is the question. I think bringing it down below 2k is the hardest thing to do. It would be nice if there was a weapon that permanently damages, like a spiral or something around you, like a flame circling you, like wherever you go, instantly everything gets hit. There isn't any contact damage weapon, there isn't any garlic weapon in this game. Everything is just weapons that you throw out, everything, like it's either a projectile, or it is something you swing, or it's something that you fling. Like there isn't any other thing in this game, everything is in those three categories, every single weapon. Unless I'm missing something, uh, which I don't think I am. So, target grade, let's go. First it is blocked. <laughs> I don't need that. Um, yeah, I mean, that's that's it. Let's go. Here, a, a, a crazy monkey. And then, look at this. We begun with slow attack speed, and now... 36,000 speed up power. Look, look, look at our damage. We're getting hit heavily, no jokes. We're actually getting very heavily hit. Yet I'm also healing heavily, don't get me wrong. But I also am getting hit very heavily. Yeah, look at how fast we're losing and gaining life. I love this. I enjoy it when we uh, when we actually get hit. I don't enjoy it when we lose, but I do enjoy it when we get hit and we lose life. Now that makes it so that the fight is actually worthwhile, you know. Now my damage is of course scaling forever. 2000% damage at this point. We're completely you not know, really busted. Yeah, but still. The community support. My fans are here trying to help us power up. Trying to help us become what we're supposed to become. Which is a power god, I guess. I don't know. Uh, I'm also thinking about maybe reducing the duration of the waves. Um, clearing, cutting, 5,000 damage done per attack. Very nice. Let's run it down. Pick up even more of the community support. What my community wants. Even more attack speed. How many community supports do we have? Do we have 100? Uh, I should get about 80, 85k if I can. 
that's the that's the plan 85k how many or however many survive however many survivors <laughs> however many subscribers we have that's how much i would like to have can i do that it would be nice let's go let's go oh i did i forgot to reduce the the duration of the wave yeah, i think i'm gonna reduce the duration of the wave i don't need to go through every single wave for 60 seconds honestly i would like to know by the way comment down below and tell me uh, by the way, before you comment, don't forget to drop a like, guys, if you want. But yeah, comment down below and tell me if you want these waves to actually last the full duration. Or if you prefer it if I do this where the waves just go and uh, end faster. Because, in my opinion, like, the main idea of these ones is to showcase the madness of the idea itself. The build itself, what it looks like. But after we achieve that, most of the time I enjoy just going through it. You know, powering up faster and faster. Because the powering is happening between waves, right? So every wave is 60 seconds. Therefore, instead of powering up every minute, I'm powering up every 30 seconds, right? We're just becoming faster and faster, stronger and stronger. Uh, that's that's at least my idea. Maybe you guys have different point of views. And uh, I would like to hear them, to be honest. So let's continue slashing through opponents here. And let's continue scaling our... Uh, thing. Our thing. <laughs> First of all, before I scale my thing, I'm gonna go with a bunch of pandas. Okay. Because, uh... Because we're most likely not gonna be getting as many boxes as we were gaining. So now we got it. Now we're back to community support. Now, of course, I butchered my damage right there. It is okay, it's not the end of the world, but I did butcher my damage. Now we're down to 2,000% damage again. Which is on the lower end of things. I mean, 4,000 damage isn't really on the lower end of things, to be completely honest. Uh, but you know what I mean. Oh, I can also buy a bunch of rats, by the way. Maybe I should also buy a bunch of rats, just so that even more opponents up here, and even more lag happens. I could do that. Yeah, maybe I should do that. Uh-oh, it's lagging. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. These opponents are really bad. Well, good thing I made the wave smaller. And lag madness. Love it. You see, that's why we went with smaller waves. I just realized that the panda gave us like a 900 life. I, I, I did not want to do that, but it is what it is. Uh, let's get some rats. Right, let's get some rats. So we increase our mouses, I guess. Yep, let's get a bunch of them. How many more points are we finding right now? Uh, where is it? Trees enemies. 400%. Let's go with 500%. Actually... I could go with ah, 500%. Let's go with 500%. I still want to continue gaining those community supports. And with all those crazy... Yeah, maybe I made a mistake with the 2000 luck idea. <laughs> Look how many bucks we're getting. Uh, it's a lot. It's a lot. Let's uh, let's go with 8 million damage. And uh, off we go. Baby with a beard could help us, by the way. Should I get baby with a beard to help us clear out trash mobs? Hmm. I'm gonna say yes. I'm gonna say yes. Yeah, let's get the baby with a beard to clear out trash mobs. And of course, this is gonna add more projectiles on the map, but those projectiles do 20 damage. So, um, yeah, 20 damage projectiles definitely help. Yeah, for sure. I mean, I, I don't need 50,000 baby with the beards. I, I just need to clear, you know, small enemies that m once in a while, right? That, that's it. That's the only difference I need. It's a bit weird that some baby with the beards shoot out to the void. Just for some reason whatsoever, just shoot out into nothingness. Nice. I hate thousand percent attack speed without anything. Let's scroll down into even more community support. Actually, you know what? Let's get e uh, let's also get a thousand percent more opponents because why not? Thousand percent more opponents. Da -da 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 -da. And here we go. Off to primary. Off to community support for the rest of this. Crit chance still not hundred uh, percent. Yeah, let's continue. Eighty-three percent crit chance. Hey, look! I think elite got sniped. If I had more range, I would lag less. Do the exact brrrr. Brrrr. Now it's gonna start with a brrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
oh, however many do we have of these 500 a million five million 10 million no, i'm kidding these numbers are completely random arbitrary and also definitely not true so uh yeah melee damage i guess trees let's go uh, and damage and lifesteal because why not we roll once just for the memes and off we go how many do we have though 70 where is it where's my community supports how can I be so blind of seeing things that I have hundreds of times here? This 539%. Let's go. 539 times more opponents. So my question is, if I pause here, will it show me the attack speed I gain from all of them or only from from each opponent? Ah, very disappointing. Very disappointing. I, I would have hoped to get, you know, to see the number there. I would have hoped to be like plus 10 million. I mean, I'm seeing my attack speed right now is 5,000%. So, uh, yeah. Madness incarnate, indeed. I love it. Continue slashing everything down. 50k. Will I be able to get a million attack speed is my question. I don't think I will. I don't. Oh, we just hit it. We literally just hit it. <laughs> the moment I said uh, maybe and I don't think I will, we instantly hit a million. When I say million, I mean 136,000. So the dream for a million is guaranteed dead. <laughs> now, that, now that I saw that we just got 100,000, it's just not happening. But still, 100,000 is good, in my opinion. So, fair. 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 Uh, movement speed. Ah, there was a crit chance. My mistake. Whatever. Try to get some crit chance. And now Anvil. Let's go! As if it even helps. Even more luck. Even more damage. Let's go. Let's go. 2000% attack speed. And... No, that was 2000% damage. Attack speed is in the thousands. 50,000, 41,000. If I try to stay in a corner with just a mass opponents, 100k, 150k, 173k, 200k, ah, let's clear them out, clear them out, clear them out. I don't have enough attacks to clear them out, are you serious? Yeah, I guess I made a mistake. I made a mistake, and we're clearing out my mistake, haha. -ha! Look how fast we move and destroy everything. Well, it is what it is. Off to the next one. Community supports. And I think the next is the final wave. If that's the case, yeah, the next is the final wave. So that is the case. I'm gonna definitely make the last wave last however much it's supposed to last. So let's go over to Game Busters and increase that to 50 times. Let's go with one time here. And um, yeah, let's go. By the way, I know there is a spawn rate here. Uh, in, in case like you're reading, <laughs> there is a spawn rate here. Spawn rate. This is extremely dangerous. This just might lag your game to death. So I'm, I'm just not gonna invest into that. I'm trying to ho ho the last community support. Let's go. By the way, I still want to this to be able to be visible. Nope, it's not visible. Two opponents, so only the bosses. Bruh, bruh. They're gonna be giving their thing now. Bruh, bruh. Oh, the boss are actually surviving, by the way. Oh, I'm losing a bunch of life. Do you see this? Do you see how much life we're losing when we get hit? Yes, I am healing extremely fast, but I also get hit very a lot. Look at my life. I hate the fact that the that the boxes are just there, but whatever. I'm trying to lose on purpose. Try, try to, time to try to lose on purpose. I'm gonna try to lose on purpose. Not that I have any control over this. My damage is at 100k. You know what? Let's actually stay. I know exactly when it ends. It ends when 100 and uh, when 176 bosses appear. So for now, we're gonna try to lose if this is even possible, as we're healing so much and we're getting so many things, and it's just maybe not borderline impossible. But uh, after this is done. Uh, when we get to 150 bosses, I will go to the corner and try to just amass attack speed. It's still at 110. As I said, 176 is when this ends. As this is how many opponents have the time to spawn. How many bosses have the time to spawn until the 80 seconds are passed. <laughs> this is so weird that sound effects the same the same. Okay, time to look to the corner play. Let's lag the PC to death. Yes, yes, 200% attack speed, 214, 229, I'm powering up, wow, 300%, let's go, community support, all my allies are close to me, help me, my allies, 300%, 147, 147, yes, we got 300%, and it just ended, 176 opponents, and done, 343%, 1000%, 300,000% attack speed, very nice, awesome, cool, love it, we got our community support, 675, yeah, Really enjoyable. Also, 1,000% more opponents. Also really enjoyable. So yeah, all in all, awesome run. I enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. As I said, pops out the channel. If you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe. I'm doing these runs every single day. And uh, yeah, at some point, hopefully, a new awesome vanilla patch is going to drop. Maybe I should do like... Do you guys want me to do... Um 
custom mods. Like, I can play other mods, other characters, other weapons, not the rainbow mods because they're not combined with them. Or maybe I'm going to even ask Dairy Yoshi to combine another mod with the rainbow mod. So we have a rainbow mod with also content patch mod. Like, there is Star Wars. There are so many content mods in this game. Uh, we can definitely play other things with Brotato. We're not forced to stay in the just the golden, uh, just the rainbow chest mod. Anyway, that is going to be it. Uh, and once again, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. And see you guys around.